Hey there NBA fans, welcome back to our channel. If you're enjoying these updates, don't forget to subscribe for more exclusive content straight from the world of basketball. Now let's dive into today's hot topic. There's been a lot of buzz surrounding Bronny James ever since he was picked up by the Los Angeles Lakers as the 55th overall draft pick in 2024. Everyone's been watching his every move, dissecting his game, and debating whether the Lakers made the right call. Well, according to one seasoned NBA executive, they absolutely did. In a recent interview with Steve Bolpet from Hev, the executive shared some insightful thoughts. I don't think it's an overreach for him to be a 55th pick. You could say it's after the year he had as a freshman, but what he accomplished before his first year, he played really well at the NBA Draft Combine. And he had a very good game at the Combine. That part, that makes him more than a valid pick. This endorsement highlights the confidence some in the NBA have in Bronny's potential. Despite the controversy surrounding his draft position, he's already making waves during the NBA Summer League, starting with the California Classic and moving on to Las Vegas. His performances have been a mixed bag, drawing both praise and scrutiny. But here's the real question. Is it fair to place such heavy criticism and high expectations on a second-round pick? As Bronny gears up for his rookie season with the Lakers, signing a standard four-year contract worth just over $7 million, it's clear that he's ready to prove himself on the big stage. His NBA debut in the California Classic against the Sacramento Kings saw him tally four points, two rebounds, and two assists. Subsequent games against the Miami Heat and Houston Rockets showcased his defensive prowess and versatility even if his offensive game has had its ups and downs. Critics point to his underwhelming freshman season at USC as cause for concern. But the NBA executive argues otherwise. I mean, I don't, don't think one year he had is an indication of who he was or what he is or certainly not what he can be. The Lakers probably saw him working out and hanging around the team. They saw something good in him. The why not take him? A lot of people saw good things in him. I think they got scared. So, what do you think, fans? Do you believe Bronny James has what it takes to silence the critics and make an impact with the Lakers? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And remember to like and subscribe for more in-depth coverage of all things NBA. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for the latest updates right here on our channel.